Okay, thank you very much. Uh, this is Andy speaking, and uh, I'd like to share with each uh, everybody, um, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, uh, my topic is applying peer rating strategy to enrich students' learning experience uh, during the period of the COVID-19. Uh -huh. So uh, in this presentation, I'll tell uh, all the audience about my experience in the COVID-19. How do I uh, do the remote teaching online? Okay, so in this uh, slide, I'll let everybody know the impact of COVID-19. COVID-19 sped up uh, remote learning in higher education and a new revolution of teaching method is arising because the teachers and the students went in and out of the hospital frequently. Uh, Taipei Medical University decided to take early epidemic protective measures and encourage most of the teachers to implement remote learning in March uh, 2020. Uh, therefore, 10 of 18 classes in the semester of the class uh, gender and mental health utilized distance learning. Uh, in this part, I'd like to talk about peer rating, how it increased learning effects. Uh, in fact, this is not easy for teachers who execute distance learning for the first time, uh, especially when they do not do not have any experiences. So it requires a strategy to attract students' attention and reactions. Uh, in my uh, idea, I try to use uh, peer rating. Uh, to attract students' attention. Peer rating is one of the idea strategy to achieve that goal. And the immediate response system, IRS, offers this kind of platform. Several studies have suggested that digital interactive technologies have been applied to increase learning motivation, but one of its important functions, uh, peer rating, is not elaborated. In order to understand the learning uh, situation of students discussing and listening to the report online, the teachers use peer rating five times in the court's mental, uh, gender and mental health to increase learning effects. So in my class, I ask students to use peer rating mechanism five times. In this five times, I, don't, uh, I have some idea about the students' learning experiences and how uh, they perform us in the classes. All right, um, so the method part in the uh, present study, uh, 39 students who took the course gender and mental health were asked five times in the spring semester 2020 to evaluate other students oral presentation with uh, simple rubric evaluation criteria, which includes two quantitative item and one qualitative item. The quantitative item includes content and attractiveness. The qualitative item includes opinions. So students will achieve uh, other students' opinions through the uh, MR, uh, IRS system. Uh, this system will provide a, a very convenient uh, method to know their performance. Students enjoy to get this kind of information. The teacher asks students to write a refractive journal for a certain uh, class in the semester. Uh, I'll suggest uh, audience to use refractive journal because in this method, we gather a lot of information and opinions from students. And Teachers can adjust their uh, teaching method uh, in this process. So it's really a, a good 
uh, method for teachers to know students' um, idea. Students' reactions data were retrieved and their opinions on remote learning from the homework of reflective journals were analyzed as well. Analyzing the results from quantitative data to understand the effect of distance learning and the benefit of peer rating. Okay, let's see uh, the result part. Results show that students enjoy in and were satisfied with this learning experiences. There are were some quotation uh, refractives. Uh, for example, first one is so good that we can have teacher-student interactions during epidemic prevention period. So students really enjoy in this kind of remote learning because uh, teachers do some good design and activities in this uh, period of time. The second one through this class, I really learn a lot. So uh, as long as we do a uh, good design, good activity. Uh, students still can learn a lot from a remote study. So uh, the interaction online uh, seems uh, less, but in fact, as long as we do some uh, peer rating or uh, activities, they still have a lot of fun in the uh, class. The third part, although it was a uh, distant learning, I could still feel the teacher's uh, enthusiasm. It was as interesting as the first few lessons at the uh, beginning of the semester, and it wasn't dull. So, so it's very apparently that uh, remote uh, learning can be as well as um, actual learning in the classroom, as long as a teacher has a um, enthusiasm to lead the class. So it's very important and uh, students can uh, feel the teacher's enthusiasm so that they also feel happy in this period of learning time. All right, another quotation is, uh, for remote learning, I needed to be familiar with computer operations. Uh, I suggest that uh, no matter student or a teacher, we all need to be more familiar with computer operations because once computer operation is blocked, um, the atmosphere of learning and all the uh, schedule will be disrupted. So uh, we need to uh, practice again and again to make our uh, computer skills better in order to um, provide good quality online studies. Uh, another one, taking a remote learning course for the first time. I was actually a little nervous. Uh, in fact, the teachers are also very nervous during the time, especially when we cannot uh, control all the skill uh, good. So that's uh, the students said that I was afraid I didn't turn off the microphone and I turned it on accidentally. Uh, it's uh, happened quite often that I also uh, sometimes uh, cannot control the voice good. Uh -huh. The overall effect was good, but it was unavoidable that I was a little uncomfortable when I uh, first used it. So it's very uh, uh, obviously that we, as long as we use a remote distance uh, more and more barriers will be less and less and the effects will be better and better. Remote learning requires mutual encouragement from teachers and the students, uh, especially when it's the first time we um, encounter COVID-19. So that teacher need to encourage students. Students will feel a little frustrated when they uh, do not uh, control the computer skill good and uh, sometimes they do not uh, um, 
receive uh, correct information from teacher. So as a teacher uh, doing the remote learning, I frequently encourage students and to empathy their uh, difficulties. I'll let them know, oh, uh, COVID-19 isn't what mm, we want, but in this very tough moment, we still need to uh, do our best to overcome all these uh, barriers. When they heard this kind of uh, comfort, they feel better and uh, they have the uh, courage to uh, further uh, keep their mind in study uh, online. So thanks to the teacher for teaching so hard. I learned a lot of practical uh, knowledge in this class so that I can learn to interact with others. And at the same time, I can review my performance and do better next time. I think I can communicate with people more skillfully and learn a lot of art of speaking. I look forward to more exciting lessons in the future. So in this quotation, we found that students still uh, feel the um, learning process uh, satisf satisfied. Uh, it's almost the same as uh, we uh, actually uh, sitting in the classroom. Okay, uh, but we, I'd like to mention about the limitation of the uh, remote learning. I really like the teacher's teaching style and the content. It was a pity that this semester had become an online course and that there were few opportunities for face-to-face -face interaction with teachers. So in this quotation, we know that students still want face-to-face -face interactions so that teachers should try their best to uh, do some online uh, at the same time um, uh, teaching. So students will feel um, they can uh, interact with teacher. Mm -hmm. uh, besides the teacher's video camera sometimes crashed. Wow, it's really a pity, huh? I really like the teacher's expression when he spoke. Uh, sometimes I couldn't see the teacher's expression. I was a little, uh, it was a pity that the image quality was a bit poor, but this was not a big problem. So um, uh, I think it's still important, even uh, the camera uh, angle is uh, still very important. So as long as students can see your uh, face expression, they will, um, they will feel your enthusiasm in the uh, remote uh, teaching. So uh, uh, technology is important and how to use it is also important. As long as these two parts combine together, we can do the um, be best quality online teaching. Okay, there are some quotations. In addition, many students did their best to provide concrete and useful feedback, like uh, the PPT is beautiful, but the talking speed is too fast, or it's rich in content and explained so brain, uh, fluently to be a teacher. So some students in their performance uh, doing a oral presentation, they can do as good as a teacher. Uh, students still can learn a lot from their uh, classmates. Uh, the second part, the expression was rich in content and theoretically based, uh, and it also analyzed the role of drama. In that part, students mentioned about a, a movie. Huh? It did not make people feel abstract. So still, uh, students need some concrete uh, images. So online teaching can still deliver that kind of information for students to do a good learning. This joke anal analysis was very detailed and the movie explanation was also very complete. Oh yes, I forgot to mention that in our class, I encourage students to do, uh, to, to, to say a joke uh, 
about uh, sexual, <laughs> um, so about gender. So uh, when they doing that online, student can have a lot of fun. And uh, explaining movie is also some student they do to try to uh, explain the communication skills of to gender. Okay, the report was done very carefully and the speech was very interesting and powerful, but the time control must pay more attention. So students also uh, emphasize if time control is good or bad. All right, the last part discussion. Uh, it's important for teachers to list all requirements clearly. It's including the deadline of all tasks. It's just like a, a real uh, class. Uh, as long as your, uh, your, your process, your rule are clear enough, students will follow easier. But if you are not, you do not provide an, uh, concrete rules, students will find it a little difficult to uh, communicate with you online. So uh, the learning process will be smoother uh, as long as we uh, make all the rule clear. A uh, mechanism is needed to deal with students' diving problem. So uh, the diving problem is uh, for example, peer rating was a good mechanism that can make students listen carefully to classmates' reports and uh, make comments. But there are always some students do not appear online. <laughs> in fact, even in the real classroom, some students won't uh, appear uh, at the classroom. So it still needs some uh, me method to avoid that kind of problem. However, there were still students who uh, couldn't uh, complete the task of listening to the report and complete peer rating. Uh, it's necessary to design more interactive activity in remote learning and the teachers need to show high enthusiasm in order to improve the learning efficiency of students and avoid lack of a warm atmosphere for students. Besides noticing students to provide their earnest and genius feedback will benefit a lot for students who were evaluated by classmates in this happy learning journey. Okay, this is my presentation. If you have any problem, please uh, raise your hand. Okay, thank you, Professor Han. Yeah, your time control is very good. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> you share a lot of from the teacher's perspective. Uh, yeah, and you mentioned that there's some uh, students cannot finish the work. Uh, uh, how do you have anything that's, uh, that they can, uh, for example, they cannot uh, finish on time. Do you have any mechanism that they can submit later or you will have some method that make them <laughs> or force them to come back? Okay, most of the time I still use uh, points to ask them to finish be before uh, the deadline. But some, student, some students still cannot uh, uh, complete that test. So sometimes I'll delay the deadline and ask them. So I think it's important, no matter in uh, actual classroom or uh, remote learning, teachers still need uh, to spend a lot of time to communicate with students, to ask them what's going on, why you cannot uh, complete it before the deadline. So don't think uh, remote learning easy <laughs> because most of the time we still need to, to uh, spend a lot of time and uh, care about uh, the course of students' learning uh, circumstance. Okay, thank you so much. Yeah, well, our time is up. Uh, is, is up. And uh, uh, if anyone uh, in the audience uh, who wants to uh, uh, make any discussion, I welcome you to go to the uh, OEG Connect so that you can discuss it later on the website. Yeah, and uh, I appreciate everybody can uh, attend this uh, session. Uh, our session will end here. 
And uh, uh, yeah, the next session will begin in 10 minutes later. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you very much. Thank you.